well by now you probably know that I finished fifth at uh, Ironman Lanzarote and with fifth place well I'm kind of well it's not terrible but it's also not the result that I came here for the goal was to qualify to Hawaii and uh, this probably won't be enough to qualify so looking from that side well I shouldn't be happy but still there were some uh, good moments during the race and uh, well I also made some mistakes without without which I could have ended up with uh, probably with better placing a mass start swim and it's been a while since I had a mass start and I didn't miss it because uh, in the first 20 seconds I already got my first head punch and I got a couple of more later and well during the swim I actually felt that I'm swimming quite well because uh, well at least for the whole time I had a group to swim to swim in and it didn't feel very easy so I was thinking that well even if it's a subpar swim it won't be terrible but uh, upon exiting the water I, they had a stopwatch at the swim exit and when I saw 56 minutes well I was I was trying to stay positive so I was thinking okay maybe the swim was longer and everybody swam slower this time disappeared because uh, 20 minutes in, into the ride <laughs> I ran into my friend who is photographer and uh, since he didn't tell me the time gaps he just <laughs> shouted some words of enc encouragement I knew that I'm not uh, doing so well and uh, well I was frustrated frustrated by the swim so I pushed the bike a little bit harder than, uh, than what I was supposed to and uh, another thing that confirmed my position after the swim was that I was uh, for the first hour and a half only passing uh, three digit start numbers so eventually after an hour and a half I caught uh, two big groups of pros and uh, after about uh, 70k I caught up with a group with uh, Cyril Viano and uh, as I considered him as one of the pre-race favorites and uh, uh, he had five minutes faster swim than me so it's obvious that I was pushing too hard on the start on, of the bike uh, he managed to follow me and uh, we did most of the ride together from that point but after about 100k uh, my power started to fade as expected and um, well I managed to pass a couple of more guys Cyril eventually dropped off the pace but also two guys passed me uh, still I got into the second transition just uh, seconds away from uh, third place I could he was within the site so not a bad position to be in um, and the bike course itself uh, it was uh, not as hilly as I expected it to be because uh, well it is hilly but uh, the hills are not so steep bigger bigger problem is the wind and uh, the the difference that that makes is that you need to push on the downhill so there is not much coasting so if you have only a slight downhill 2% with the side wind you need to push all the time so not much rest on, the, on this bike course third place in sight I got a bit overexcited on the start of the run and uh, I moved into the third position after I think four kilometers and held that for the next uh, 10 uh, well from the start of the run I didn't feel I didn't feel smooth it felt like it's going to be a long day but for example I felt similar in Italy and still managed to do 250 run 249 I think so I was hoping with uh, if I move into the third place adrenaline adrenaline will do its thing and I will be able to hold it until the end 
uh, unfortunately Cyril was uh, running really strong and at the moment when he passed me I was already started I started to decline in pace and uh, couldn't follow him and then well that decline continued throughout the run so uh, towards the end of it I think in the last 5k I lost another position and finished in fifth spot so fifth uh, well regarding uh, Kona qualification fifth doesn't get me too much points now I have around 3,000 I think well I think border last year for qualification was just over 3,000 so theoretically I might even get in but uh, now I will do Ironman Nice and try to get a better result there in order to qualify and uh, well that's it that that was the plan B and unfortunately I have to cancel my participation at Kesselly Triathlon which is a very nice event and I'm I'm not happy to miss that but uh, well I have to take care of the priorities uh, all in all it was a great race uh, and I need to make um, an um, apology because uh, they even had live coverage during the race and uh, I think I will be back here because I like the course and uh, it's, it's a very nice place the island is very nice uh, I didn't see well the bike course leads you through the whole island but I didn't see much of it so in the past two days uh, we rented a scooter and uh, rode through the island and it's really beautiful it's a nice place to visit and uh, I will be back here for sure. So, until next time, ciao!